Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out Castle of Glass by Sereger. I started creating a hammer map last summer, which is going to have 18 rooms, each having a separate puzzle with all of them together making it for a way bigger puzzle, and an easter egg that makes the puzzle twice as hard if you're trying to get it. 60 hours in, I'm like 40-50% done, but I didn't have any time lately because of my studies, so I'll get back to it next summer. In that puzzle, each individual room has its own name, and this map is the remake of two rooms I called Castle of Glass Together. It has some minor changes to make this puzzle playable standalone without the other rooms. Difficulty 6 out of 10 normal. Moving a cube while aiming it at the receptacle is NOT part of the solution. Have fun, and feedback is welcome and appreciated. Um, yeah, I'm not- I don't- I don't want to play this 18-room hammer map, so, uh, don't send it to me. But I'll definitely play this. Let's- let's check out this map. Please continue into the next test chamber. Sure thing, GLaDOS. Which involves deadly lasers, and how test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. I'm sure it does. I'm sure it does, GLaDOS. Right, well, right off the bat, we've already got one of these classic Fizzler maces that drives me insane. What does this do? Eh, guess that's a toggle. Interesting. Where does Square go to? Square the dropper? I guess... No, square is that? Right, because that ant line goes to the dropper. Okay. Hmm. Well, we've got some cubes in here to work with, at least. That's something, I guess? Let's move this cube out of here. And then. Try this. Well, I guess we can take this cube up here. I don't actually know what's up here though. Let's go ahead and save. Cause this cube respawns at like the blink of an eye, so. Hmm. So this fizzler is what gets turned off by that. Hmm. Why would we want that though? Not exactly clear on the concept there. Why would we want this... to be turned off, I mean... That's our goal. Also, how do I get back down? I guess through here, right? Aha, uh -huh, yeah, okay. What if I take this cube through here with me, though? But now we have a bit of an issue. What if we do that? I don't really think that's particularly helpful, but we can do it. It's a thing we can do, so I shall do it. Yeah, not particularly helpful. Also, that- that's not even a portal surface, so... Where do- where do I go... how do I get... Of, oh! Oh, that's what, the one we need. Interesting. Oh, come on! <laughs> Are you serious right now? Did that actually just happen? Ah... Uh, what the heck controls this? Oh, what in the world? How is that even supposed to be done? I mean, we guess we have to get a cube up here somehow, but... I have many other questions. Alright, alright. Let's do this rigmarole again. I guess we don't actually need the funnel on right now, right? Hmm. Here's what we'll do. Let's do that first. There we go. There's that problem solved. There's that problem solved. Eh. 
And there's this problem solved. How do we get in there again? Does this fizzler ever turn off? It doesn't look like it, unfortunately. Hmm. And when would we want to use that, I wonder? That's alarming, the other one's alarming, we only have three cubes! Alright, let's do this the smart way. There we go. Oh, but this doesn't turn off either, except for with that. Oh no. Ah. Uh. Alright, so first of all, we need to move this guy... ...to here. Then there's... Oh, are you kidding me? Come on now. Aim yourself. There you go. Then we go up here... And I guess... from here, we need to... to ...do this. That'd be my guess. And then we drop... That back down. I've said before, but I'm really not a fan of fizzler mazes like this. It's just arbitrary nonsense. Alright, so that's that. How does that help, though? Like, there's no way to get any other cube up here, because this fizzler right here never turns off. So it's not possible to get any other cubes up here except for the red one. though. Would placing a cube up there even be intended? I feel like it's not intended, but... I guess there's only one way to find out. Okay, so first of all... Safety blocker. There's that. Alright. Save and continue. Hope that's intended, because if not, I have no idea what to do other than that. And then we do the same thing here. Are you kidding me right now? Holy crap. <laughs> why, game, why? Oh, and we got different music? Ah, well. I like the music that was playing, but this music works too, I guess. Hmm. Right, we go this direction. Alright, let's try not to fizzle it this time. There we go, that works. I don't even know how I did that before, like, somehow it just went flying over into the sizzler. Right, so, now... Uh, excuse me. Sir, move out of the way, please. Weird. Alright, so now we can finally get the red cube back. I mean, out, not back. Red cube acquired. Alright. I'll put that there for now. I still have no idea what the point of this whole fizzler thing is for. And it scares me. Right, well, uh... I guess now we need to respawn the green cube? What's the best way to do that? There's no manual respawns in here, right? I guess we just fizzle it and it auto-respawns, right? go with, we fizzle it in an auto-response. Hmm. 
So, how about you and me have a little heart to heart in that direction? Get over there. Get over there. I kicked that cube into the fizzler. Right. I still have no idea what I'm doing right now. I'm mostly just shuffling cubes around and hoping that it makes some kind of progress or something. This fizzler never turns off. I mean, the only way to get over over to the exit with a portal is to turn off this fizzler and this fizzler. So not necessarily at the same time. I think that's what this up here is for, is that we would have to turn off this one first, and then point the laser cube up, and then do that. Yeah, that's... that's gonna be a, a royal pain, though. Also, which cube do we need up over here? Like, what's- what even- what is even gonna happen when we do that? Alright, I need you to safety guard me. There we go. Alright, so. That should safety guard us from accidental triggers. Save. Come on now. Come on now! Oh my gosh, this is beyond infuriating. Why is this a thing that exists? There we go. Ah. <sighs> Why does that have to be that way? That is just infuriating. Alright, alright, alright. Back to the Fizzler Maze nonsense. Let's figure out what the deal was with all of this. Whichever cube we leave up here... ...has got to be one that doesn't respawn at the drop of a hat, so... Let's, uh, do this, I suppose. Okay, good. Let's bring this one up here. Still don't know why I needed to bring the red cube down, honestly. Ah, oh, crap, I needed the red cube in here, didn't I? Alright, let's- let's fix that- crap. Let's fix that first. Uh, okay, that's not too terrible, at least. Let's try that again, please. Uh, hmm. That... is rather... an issue, isn't it? Hmm. Well, safety first. We'll do that. And we'll do the safety mechanism. No! Why? Why did that happen? Why does that have to be so infuriating? Alright, let's try this again. Maybe this time it'll be less infuriating. Okay. That time, nothing bad happened. Good. So now what we need to do... is this. There we go. That's really how it should've been in the first place. I didn't actually need it pointed in this direction at all, I don't think. Right, we need the red cube... point up. I think the problem, though, is that I can't do this yet. Yeah... At least I want to experiment with it to make sure I understand what I'm doing. But this is, I think, the last thing I have to do, actually. Cause 
we can come out of that portal any old time. Yeah, there we go. Alright, so, I understand that now. That's all understood. Now let's go back, and... Gosh, I guess the easiest thing to do would just be the restart from the beginning here. Guy over. Do this. No, no. Do that. Bring this guy up here. Alright. Now here's the part I'm not too terribly sure about. Do that for now. Cause I think I want to put a portal there and then make my way back somehow, but I'm not entirely sure how to make that happen in any capacity. Do that. That helps us in any capacity. Hmm. Actually, you know what? How do we want to do this, actually? I think we need this fizzler off first. So let's move this out of the way. Yeah, because we come out here. Alright, let's get up here. I think I actually do want to swap the cubes first, though. Yeah, that's the thing. I need to swap the cubes first. Right, well, back to that, I suppose. Yeah, we need to swap the cubes, like I did before already. Let's do this again. We can set this up again later with the red cube or whatever. Alright, there's that. Walk over here, go up this. Point this in the proper direction. There we go. Let's put the green cube up again. There we go. Alright. Then we do this part again. There we go. Alright, so now we can swap these guys out. Ah, uh, excuse me, sir. Would you mind moving ever so slightly? Thank you. Alright, now... I think the blue cube we want to be the furthest from victory. the red cube we want to be in there. Let's see here. Do that. Put the red cube in here. Maybe not. Maybe not. Let's put the red cube here, actually. The blue cube furthest from everything, really. There we go. 
save. And continue. Alright, let me do this. Cause this can respawn into the room where we can access it. There we go. Alright, so. Point. Let's just go ahead and place their portal. I'm still not entirely sure what that button's for, but maybe we can find out someday. There's that taken care of. Gotta be very careful here. What? Just happened right, that happened. Okay, good. Whew. Okay. <laughs> That scared me, I thought I fizzled a different cube than what I was expecting. That little tile there is a bit frustrating. And that's why you quick save. But holy crap, that cube spun, man. It spun so fast. Right. There's that. Yeah, I think we got back the song I like, so that's nice. There we go. Alright, so then... I think finally we can maybe do this. There we go. Alright. I think I finally did it. That was quite an ordeal, but, uh, we did it. Come on, come on! There we go. We head up here. Come on, there we go. Alright. I'm not sure what the pedestal button was for, I think it's just supposed to be a convenience while realigning the cubes or something, but I didn't have to use it, so, uh... Yeah. That was definitely a logic puzzle. Uh, it was just a bit... a little bit frustrating, but otherwise it was good. Alright. Well guys, as always, thank you so much for Your watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another draw. video. Goodbye! Is impossible, deadly, cruel, and one